Hi, I'm Paul Hewlett, Managing Director of MFB Group Holdings. Uh, we have two brands. Uh, we have Viraguard, which does virus protection, and MFB Group PPE, that supplies really cost-effective, high-quality PPE solutions. Yeah, of course. It's, uh, we, we've done some quite extensive studies now over the last six months uh, with the schools that we've treated versus what we know about the schools that we haven't treated. So if I talk about the schools we haven't treated first, what's generally been happening in schools that haven't had our uh, protection system deployed is they're having uh, COVID cases in school related back to the school. They're having to send pupils home multiple times in sometimes quite vast numbers. Um, members of staff are having to isolate, which means the pupils then don't have their regular member of staff to teach them. And the school either then have to send those pupils home or they have to then bring in a substitute teacher to teach those pupils, which then increases cost to the school. Um, so that's the, really the impacts of um, not having the school protected. So what we found is once we've protected a school, there's various different processes that we undertake to make sure that the school uh, are fully aware of the situation with virus control before we've done anything, the situation immediately after we've done it, and the benefits and the results eight weeks after we've done the treatment, what that means. So what we do for the school is we undertake three separate swab tests at the school where we test some untreated areas, we test some treated areas. Uh, we use something called a luminescence meter, um, which tells us the chemical degradation on surfaces and we've produced quite a comprehensive report for the school so they can be really certain that what we've done for them is actually working.